Hi, my name is Roger Rindler. I'm uh, one of the owners here at Preferred Insurance Center and uh, just kind of want to share a few things with uh, you about the agency and uh, hopefully let you know why I think this would be a good choice for you for your insurance needs. Uh, I've been in insurance for 33 years and uh, insurance has always been a good profession for me. But I got to admit the last few years, uh, my attitude has changed a little bit. Uh, we got a little more excitement within the agency. You'll see I'm wearing pink. Uh, we have flamingos that uh, tend to uh, come and go here. So things have changed. We got some fresh young blood here. So we, we really enjoy not only coming to work, but we enjoy serving you as well. Now you may ask, why should you insure at uh, Preferred Insurance Center? Uh, I guess the standard answer is we have great employees, we have great companies, we got great rates, we uh, have great service. But I got to thinking about that and I suppose every agency would probably say the same thing. So I thought I'll give you an example of one of our situations and then I'll let you decide whether you think this is great service and is something that you maybe would like to tap into. Uh, I'm going to begin this story at the end and then I'll backtrack to the beginning and I think you'll understand why. The end of the story is our client's brother called us as he wanted some quotes for his insurance. He was not a client at the time. Now I'll go to the beginning of the story. It was a Saturday night, probably about 10.30 in the evening. It was summertime, storms had just come through and uh, I received a call from one of our clients. I did not know this person. I did not set their insurance up. Another agent had done it, uh, but they were one of our clients. She got my number off the website. And what had happened was a, a large branch had gone through the, uh, the roof on their second story of their house and was actually pierced the roof and into their bedroom. She called me, was frantic, didn't know what to do. They had some help down there that was cleaning the place up. So I went down there. Got there about 10, uh, excuse me, got there about 11 or 11.30 on a Saturday night. I told them what to do, how their policy would respond, how to go forward, what things they should expect going forward. Uh, just tried to, for lack of a better term, just lend them a helping hand and put their arm around and let them know everything was going to be okay. Up until that time, we had simply sold them a promise. Now was our time to deliver the promise. Uh, long story short, the claim got handled properly, everything, the client was satisfied. Now I'll move back to the end of the story. That call I got from her brother. He said the only reason he called us to get a quote was because we were willing to show up at 1130 on a Saturday night and help his sister. Now I'll let you decide whether you think that's the kind of service that you want from an agency. We're not going to be perfect all the time. But we are always going to strive to give you that type of service. We know in this day and age that you have uh, dot coms. You can call, go on your computer. You can uh, try to get a quote in a short amount of time. Uh, you have a lot of options out there. But will you be able to sit across the desk from that person that you called and discuss your insurance with them? Will you be able to say, I have a problem. What can I do? Well, the next time you call, will you get the same person? Will they really know you? We know our clients. We will sit across the desk from you and talk to you. Now, is that a good thing that when we deliver that service? We think it is because one of two things will happen at that point. First thing is you can say, Roger, you and your team did a great job. Pat us on the back, give us our compliments, whatever you might want to do. The other side of that coin is if you don't think we did a good job, if you think we could have done something better, if you think we were missing something somewhere, you can also come in here and tell us where we failed, where we could do better. You can put your hands around my neck if you think I deserved it and say, wake up, this is what you need to do. But in either case, we will be here. We will sit across the, the desk from you and we will talk to you. We will help you. We will learn from our mistakes and obviously we'll take the compliments if they come as well. That is why we think you ought to insure here. Are we perfect? No, but we will always work hard for you and we will always strive for perfection. That's why you ought to insure for us. Thank you for listening to me and you have a great day.